Hi. Hi. I got a delivery for Janie. You could just sign this for me, please. Okay. What is that? Thank you very much. Who sent you this, girl? You must be doing something right for somebody sending you this big flower. <gasps> They're so pretty. I'm not sure who these flowers are from, but I think I have an idea. Who have you been talking to? Thinking of you. So, <laughs> P.S. I'm looking forward to our date. Are you blushing? That's cool. A little. Wow! Stop! I think now I feel like like I have to go on the date. Huh? Yes. Don't you want to? You look a little confused here. At least we can go to like a lunch or something. Why don't right? just go full swing? You know? Because I want to get to know him. I don't know. Like I just. I mean, I've known him for a long time, but this is different. I'm, it's obviously... well, you guys must be talking about something because these are pretty big flowers. Okay, I'm gonna go. I'm just... Wow! Look at that face, girl. There is absolutely no way I can back out of this because this guy is determined. He is persistent. Wow. Homie, <laughs> stop. They're pretty, though, right? Yeah. Good job, Zoe. Hi. Hey, how are yes. you? Good, how are you? Good. Very nice to meet you. you. Sit wherever you feel comfortable. There's a lot going on in my life right now, and I feel the need to talk to a therapist. So what brings you in today? Well, <laughs> um... I just got out of a relationship. I was in for almost five years. Mm -hmm. We were engaged and I'm starting to realize that I have like trust issues. I want to commit, but I think I'm almost scared of, of commitment. Yeah. <laughs> and I'm kind of everywhere when it comes to all that. I don't know if I'm ready to start dating. Part of me wants to, but I know that I'm not healed completely. And before I involve anyone else in my life, I want to make sure that my heart is okay. What do you think is the reason why your last relationship failed? I think it was quite a few things. I just think that we were always just very different. We came from different worlds, but mm -hmm. it just started feeling like it was just, it was always me carrying the relationship and got I just it. got exhausted. Because it was just too heavy on my heart mm -hmm. and it was becoming somewhat toxic. I was in a very, very tough relationship for five years. You know, we had beautiful moments, but at the end of the day, it was a hard relationship. And I just think that I'm a little jaded <laughs> in, in the love aspect of things. Obviously, I don't want to be single for the mm -hmm. rest of my life. I, I want to find a good guy. I just, how do I balance? Yeah, I'm a bad bitch, but then he needs to like know, hey, wait a second, I'm the man. Yeah. You're not always in control, and you sure yeah. you shouldn't be. It should be a, a nice balance, you know? I, I think it's amazing that you want to be a bad bitch. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's awesome. <laughs>